hey guys welcome back to my channel i have a mod to unbox for you today it's by vapor storm this is the puma box mod and i got it in forever love so right now let's go ahead and just show you around the box all right so we got your back around the the front of the box you have a magnetic flap right here very nice <laughs> let's go ahead and unfold it here and there you go you got a vapor storm up here and you have all the specs here you got 0.1 second burn heat high security overcharge protection over discharge protection wow mm. all right so let's push this back I'll show you what's inside you do have this battery caution card here battery ones this is how it's supposed to be right here all right so we have a vape storm certificate of inspection it passed and we have a vapor storm user's manual tell you where everything comes in this little thing has a lot y'all it has tcr mode bypass mode over puffing protection, uh, atomizer short circuit and no atomizer protection, low voltage protection, temperature alert. Yeah, this thing has a lot of stuff, y'all. <laughs> That's good though. And then you have a USB power cord. So yeah. And so here is the main part right here. Let's go ahead and move this aside. Come in this little sleeve here. All right, isn't she a beauty? This is the print is forever love. I love it. It's very very colorful. I love it. So at the top you have the five pin connection here. Spring loaded. I don't have anything to push down in there, but yeah. Right here you have your button. Very clicky. Everything is printed. The button, everything. Have your little screen here you have your up and down buttons very clicky as well and then you have your port here for charging turn around just beautiful overall i love it then you have your battery doors with these little slits here before right here you open it up it is magnetized honey this, this thing it this battery door ain't going nowhere you got back magnets here magnets there and then right here but it's embedded in the plastic yes this is made out of plastic here is the inside of the battery door puma 2 200 watts vapor storm yes mm -hmm. so here's the inside of the mod itself you got this it's not a really long ribbon then it has vapor storm on here very nice you have your battery uh placement here you have your spring loaded um stubs here I don't know the, the um, correct term, but yeah. <laughs> and it's marked plus and minus and the battery direction as well. So without further ado, let's go ahead and put some batteries in. I have my own life batteries right here. All right, so. And there you go. There you go. There's it's no rattling, y'all. No battery door rattling, no buttons rattling. And I'm pretty shaking it pretty hard too. So yeah, it's no certain way that you have to put this battery door on. Either way, how you put it, it's fine. I just like to put it this way because it says you are very special upright. So yeah. <laughs> so let's turn the screen on. Oh, I must have them in there wrong. Lord. All right. So I had to get some more batteries. So here are the batteries in here, and on this door and here we go here is that screen it's pretty bright screen as well so we have power and let's go back okay uh 50 watts i have it on 50 watts you have your 200 fahrenheit w your battery indicators your your voltage your amps your ohms and your seconds so let's go ahead and put my atomizer on here i have my ferro mini here in the silver it says, oh, this is the old one. So I'm gonna press it. Here it is. So this is, the the voltage is 4.09. The resistance is 
0.33 and 54 seconds. Y'all, listen to this. I mean, it has no ramp up time. You press that button, it's firing. No ramp up time. Yep. Very, very nice. You can put this thing on 20 and you would have thought that it was on 50 or 60. That's how much vapor come out with 20 watts. So, yeah, that's pretty much it of my unboxing, this slight review of this Puma by VaporStorm. Hope you like it. So, let's go up top and I'll tell you about the pros and cons. So, guys, to be honest with you, I haven't found a con with this Puma. I love the graphics on it. It just performs well. The menu screen is it's cute to me. It looks a little bunchy, but I can read it and I can read it well. So, yeah, it ramps up very quick, ve very quick, very quick. I'm very impressed with that. So, yeah, the battery, there's no shaking of the buttons, no battery rattle or nothing like that. The magnets hold well. Yeah, I have no cons. Those were all my pros. <laughs> so, yeah, let's take a talk on it. Oh, yeah, very good. Yeah, so that was a little, my little slight review and an unboxing of the Vape Storm Puma and the Forever Love. Hope you enjoyed it. Please give me a thumbs up, comment below, and if you haven't already, please subscribe. All right, guys, vape on.